everyone. Thanks for joining us here on CBS News 24 7. I'm Lindsay Riser. Here's a look at the top stories we're following right now. Hurricane Milton gets closer to Florida's Gulf Coast with the expected landfall coming as soon as tomorrow. Forecasters say Milton will likely lose some strength today, but warn that if the hurricane stays on its current track, it will be the worst to hit the Tampa area in more than a century. Plus, the Supreme Court is hearing arguments today over the Biden administration's efforts to regulate so-called ghost guns. The challengers in the case want to throw out regulations enacted by the ATF in 2022 that subject untraceable firearms to the same requirements as commercially made guns. And Vice President Kamala Harris is making media appearances today on The View, The Howard Stern Show, and The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. Meanwhile, former President Donald Trump is also in New York City, scheduled to take part in a health care focused virtual town hall tonight. Evacuation orders are in effect as Hurricane Milton heads closer to landfall in Florida. The state is projected to hit the state's Gulf, the storm rather, projected to hit the state's Gulf Coast as early as tomorrow night. Milton could dump roughly 18 inches of rain while heading toward the Atlantic Ocean. That path would largely spare other states battered by Helene, which has killed about at least 230 people. But Florida, which was also impacted by Helene, is bracing for those rain totals, hurricane force winds and storm surge in some areas as high as 15 feet. President Biden is postponing an overseas trip to Germany and Angola to oversee storm preps and response. He says federal and state officials are doing everything they can to prepare. I directed this team to do everything it can to save lives and our communities, help our communities before, during, and after these extreme weather events. Uh, and, uh, and that's being done. That's being done. I've spoken to all the political leaders in the region, some of them more than once, and uh, they, uh, they, I've told them anything they ask for they can get. They, we've given and we've got an overwhelming response. CBS News correspondent Christian Benavides is in St. Petersburg, Florida. Christian, what are officials there doing to prepare for Milton? Lindsay, well, they're warning folks that.